Ever notice how you're always thirsty no matter how much water you drink? That might not be normal. In fact, it could be your body waving a red flag. Diabetes affects over 34 million Americans. But here's the scary part. One in five don't even know they have it. By the time most people get diagnosed, they've already had diabetes for four to seven years. Let's talk about the early warning signs your body might be sending you, often before things get really serious. And you know what? Some of these signs are things most doctors rarely mention. So how do you know if a symptom is worth paying attention to? Here's a quick checklist. It sticks around for more than two weeks. It's a noticeable change from what's normal for you. And it actually starts to affect your daily life. If you're nodding along to any of these, keep watching because these signals could be more important than you think. First up, you are making too frequent visits to the bathroom. If you suddenly need to pee constantly, including waking up many times at night, this happens because excess sugar in your bloodstream forces your kidneys into overdrive. When blood sugar rises above 180 milligrams per deciliter, it spills into your urine, dragging water along with it. This isn't just an occasional bathroom trip. We're talking about urinating more than seven times daily with urgency that disrupts your life. The real danger? This constant urination reduces your body of essential minerals and can lead to dangerous dehydration if left unchecked. Have you noticed changes in your bathroom habits lately? And while frequent urination is concerning, wait until you hear about what happens to your skin. Mysterious skin tags and dark patches. Those small flesh-colored growths appearing on your neck and armpits and groin, they're not just cosmetic annoyances, they're potential diabetes warning signs. Skin tags often appear alongside dark, velvety patches called acanthos nigricans. These changes happen because insulin resistance affects skin cell growth. The patches typically show up on body folds, neck creases, armpits, and groin areas. What makes this symptom so valuable is that it's visible. You can literally see metabolic changes happening on your skin before blood tests catch them. When was the last time you checked your skin folds for unusual changes? But skin changes are just the beginning. The next symptom affects how your body recovers from even minor injuries. The never-ending paper cut. That tiny cut that's still there weeks later High blood sugar significantly impairs your body's natural healing processes. A patient once told me about a paper cut that stayed open for three weeks, something that should have healed in just days. Elevated glucose levels damage blood vessels and reduce circulation to extremities while also weakening your immune response. The practical impact is that major injuries linger, increasing infection risk. If you notice cuts, scrapes, or bruises taking unusually long to heal, your blood sugar might be the culprit. This healing delay often appears before other symptoms, making it an early warning sign most people dismiss. Does it seem like your body isn't bouncing back from minor injuries the way it used to? And while slow healing is subtle, the next symptom is one you'll definitely feel. The afternoon energy crash. That overwhelming fatigue that hits around 2 to 3 p.m. isn't just from a boring meeting. When your cells can't properly use glucose for energy, profound fatigue results. This isn't normal tiredness. It's a bone deep exhaustion that persists even after a full night's sleep. Your cells are essentially starving in the midst of plenty unable to access the glucose floating in your bloodstream. The difference between normal fatigue and diabetes-related exhaustion? The latter doesn't improve with rest alone and often worsens after meals. Many people with diabetes say it feels like they're dragging themselves through the day, almost as if they're moving through molasses. 
It's not just regular tiredness. This kind of fatigue sticks around no matter how much you rest, making it even simple daily tasks feel exhausting and slow. When was the last time you felt truly energetic throughout the entire day? But energy problems are just one way diabetes affects your daily life. The next symptom impacts something you do every day. Blurry vision after meals. If text messages suddenly look fuzzy after lunch, your blood sugar might be to blame. High glucose levels cause fluid shifts in your eye's lens, temporarily changing its shape and distorting vision. Unlike age-related vision changes, diabetes-related blurriness fluctuates throughout the day, often worsening after carb-heavy meals. What makes this symptom particularly valuable is its timing. The connection between eating and vision changes provides a clear cause and effect relationship that points directly to blood sugar problems. Many patients report this symptom is most noticeable when checking their phones after meals or when driving home after restaurant dinners. Have you noticed your vision quality changing at different times of the day? The next symptom is even more surprising, and it's one dentists often spot first. Gum disease that won't quit. Bleeding gums when brushing might not just be poor dental hygiene, it could signal diabetes. Elevated blood sugar creates the perfect environment for oral bacteria to thrive, leading to persistent gum inflammation. Studies show people with uncontrolled diabetes are three times more likely to develop severe periodontal disease. The connection works in both ways. Gum disease makes blood sugar control more difficult, creating a dangerous cycle. If you've maintained the same dental routine but suddenly developed gum problems, your glucose levels might be the hidden cause. When was the last time you noticed pink in the sink after brushing? But all these symptoms pale in comparison to our final and most overlooked sign, the phantom itch. That maddening, unexplained itchiness, especially in your extremities, might be your nerves reacting to high blood sugar. This isn't normal itching from dry skin. Diabetes-related itching often affects specific areas, lower legs, feet, ankles, and sometimes genital areas. It typically worsens at night and doesn't respond well to regular moisturizers. The science behind this symptom involves both nerve damage and yeast growth, which thrive in high glucose environments. What makes this symptom particularly valuable is that it often appears before any pain or numbness from nerve damage. This persistent itching can significantly impact sleep quality and daily comfort, yet most people never connect it to potential diabetes. Do you have any mysterious itchy spots that just won't go away no matter what creams you try? Let us know in the comments below. And if you've noticed any of these early diabetes symptoms, don't ignore them. Your body is giving you a crucial warning. The good news is taking action now can make a huge difference. If you want to know exactly what steps you can take to turn things around, check out our video, Nine Tips to Reverse Pre-Diabetes Fast. It's packed with practical strategies you can start today to protect your health and reclaim your energy. Tap the image on the screen and remember to like this video and subscribe for more practical tips and expert insights every week.